Hoosier Ag today here with Jenny Purcell, ADA of Indiana. We are here fueling up to play 360 at the Colts Complex today. Uh, talk a bit about ADA's involvement in all of this and, and how it got started. Sure. Fuel Up to Play 60 is the collaboration with the NFL, so the Colts here, which really bring the excitement. And they talked about getting active for 60 minutes a day. And then us, the um, Na National Dairy Council, we know about nutrition. So we talk about getting fueling up and getting those nutrient-rich foods, including uh, you have the lean meats and milk and dairy and fruits and vegetables and grains and doing all that and making sure they get their activity too. And you added a new partnership this year with oatmeal. Am I correct in that? Yeah, so Quaker, and they're saying Quaker up. And I don't know, Larry, who I didn't know his name was Larry, but the icon on Quaker, it actually is the milk mustache. So we're talking about making your oatmeal with milk for extra protein and nutrition. And you do have Pat McAfee here today, kind of fan favorite, the Colts punter. Uh, talk a bit about some of the energy he's bringing to the event, getting the kids excited. So again, you have a registered di dietitian like me, that doesn't get kids excited about getting active and eating right. NFL player like K Pat McAfee, he does. So that's why we are the partnership with the Colts. And he's talking about what he does to get active and he how he's successful in the field. And that really gets the kids excited. And who do we have here today? There are a lot of kids. Where are they coming from? From all over the state. We have kids and parents and Fuel Up to Play 60 advisors. Who, those are the people that are helping the kids get involved. And we have a lot of people from the Department of Education are here and just really talking about how Fuel Up to Play 60 can work for them. And in terms of exposure for this event to consumers and to parents, how has it been going? Do you see more events like this happening in the future? Yes, this was the first time we actually included the community and parents and uh, this many people to be. So we were a little worried because we have about close to 500 people here and usually in the uh, past it was 100. So I think we're going to continue to getting the community because that's our next stop to really include the community in this in-school nutrition program. And with the in-school nutrition program, it, it can only benefit dairy farmers to know that parents are getting that consumer education as well throughout this process. That's right. So we're in the schools talking about eating right, including drinking milk with your meals. And a lot of these people, dairy farmers, they have their children that are in, in benefiting from the Fuel to Play 60 um, schools uh, program as well.